In the increasingly complex regional security context in Southeast Asia, the Philippines is exploring various options to strengthen its air defense. One weapon system that has attracted attention is the Type 81 surface-to-air missile from Japan. This system offers various advantages that can contribute significantly to the Philippines' defense capabilities. Recently another missile system that could be provided or transferred to the Philippines is the Type 81 surface-to-air missile from Japan. This is a surface-to-air missile currently used by the Japanese Ground Self-Defense Forces. The Type 81 surface-to-air missile, also known as the Type 81, is an air defense system developed by Japan. This system is designed to detect, track and destroy various air threats, such as fighters, helicopters and missiles. With a combination of advanced radar and mobile launchers, the Type 81 is able to provide flexible and responsive protection across a variety of battlefields. Since Japan has confirmed that the Philippines has requested for the transfer or sale of Japanese-made air defense missile systems to improve our country's overall air defense capabilities, there are many options for our country for air defense missile systems from Japan. One of them is the famous Type 81 surface-to-air missile. The Type 81 was developed by Toshiba to replace the M51 Skysweeper 75mm and the M15A 137mm anti-aircraft gun. This can be seen as a mobile short-range missile system that will fill the performance gap. Through the FIM-92 Stinger Man portable missile and the larger MIM-23 Hawk missile system all of these missile systems are equally active in the Japanese ground self-defense forces. Development of the Type 81 began in 1966 while the first test firing took place in 1978. The system was put into service in 1981 and in 1987, minor changes were made to the system where the 1B surface-to-air missile was designated. The Mang Idol Type 81 weighs 100 kilograms, has a length of 2.7 meters, a diameter of 160 millimeters, a wingspan of 600 millimeters and a warhead of 9.2 kilograms. The engine is a Nissan motor single-stage solid-fuel rocket motor with an operational range of 0.5 to 14 kilometers. It has a flight ceiling of 15,000 to 3,000 meters and a maximum speed of Mach 2.9. The Type 81's long guidance system is a Kawasaki Heavy Industries inertial guide with Toshiba passive infrared homing for thermal guidance. The launch platform is the Type 73 6x6 motor-stacked armored mobile truck. Currently, this system is used in the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force, the Japan Air Self-Defense Force, and the Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force. 57 firing units are being served by the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force out of an initial requirement of 76. 30 units are being served by the Japan Air Self-Defense Force, while 6 units are being served by the Maritime Self-Defense Force. Japan is ready to help the Philippines to strengthen and make it a strong partner in the future. This is done by taking advantage of the growth of the manufacturing industry and the younger generation population. The Philippines also believes that they can help Japan in the future because Japan has a strong technological and financial base but is weak due to their declining population. The potential receipt of the Type 81 surface-to-air missile by the Philippines can be considered a strategic step to strengthen the country's defense posture amidst increasing tensions in the South China Sea. By strengthening its capabilities in air defense, the Philippines is expected to increase deterrence against external threats and maintain its territorial sovereignty. The Type 81 is the ideal choice for the Philippines for its air defense missile system. If the Type 81 surface-to-air missile system is moved, 
It will be a big boost for our country as it will serve as the Philippines' front line of defense. Apart from the Type 81 and our first feature, the Hawk Air Defense Missile System is an excellent choice for our country as is the Type 11 Short Range Air Defense Missile System and the Type 03 Medium Range Air Defense Missile System which are both produced by Japan. His idol, Japan is a good partner for our country because it really helps our country such as transferring technology to make our own weapons. The decision to acquire the Type 81 also shows the growing cooperation between the Philippines and Japan. This not only strengthens bilateral relations, but also creates strategic partnerships in facing common security challenges in the region. The Type 81 surface-to-air missile from Japan is an attractive option for the Philippines in facing its growing security challenges. This system not only offers necessary defense capabilities, but also opens up opportunities for cooperation and expertise development between the two countries. With this step, the Philippines seeks to strengthen its air defenses to face an increasingly uncertain future.